Hey guys, how you all doing? Rahul here, and today we're going to be catching some more scripting kiddies with the Overwatch system in Counter-Strike. Maybe we'll catch ourselves a Wooler boy, maybe an Aimer, who knows what we're going to be getting against. Maybe we'll get a little Griefer boy who wants to just sit AFK and spawn, but that'll be a bit boring. I'm hoping for some hacker, spin botter kind of guy. I, I want to see some spin bots, they'll be pretty fun. Anyway, let's load up, let's get into the game. So it looks like today we're going to be playing some Dust 2. Dust 2 is one of the uh, main maps I noticed that do have um, the suspects on. But we've got the suspect, he's using the AK today and uh, he's uh, waiting for those pre-nades. So um, we'll have to see. His crosshair placement is uh, pr pretty decent. Um, it's not looking straight down at the floor like I've seen some um, people in the Overwatch. But uh, he's, he's going, he's um, sneaking out slightly. He possibly knows there's that guy there. I mean, he was waiting for him. Oh. He was flashed there and he did get that kill, so possibly having walls at the moment, but um, I'm not too sure. He did peek out there, spotted that guy, and um, I don't know what he's trying to do now. I don't know why he switched that. I would prefer the AK, but maybe this guy prefers the M4. And um, he is, like, really cautious to go and peek out there. And, um, oh, yeah, I, I am kind of thinking this guy's using walls. And if he knows that this guy's here, then um, I'm guessing 100% walls. Yeah, he's shifting. Why would you shift here? You wouldn't expect that guy to have pushed all the way up to... Um, up up to your spawn and come out and uh, yeah there we go he yeah this guy pretty much i i'm, I'm gonna say using walls uh we'll, we'll watch a, a couple more rounds and then i'll show you actually how you can fast forward right to the end if you know for 100 percent he's using walls but so far um i'm i'm just gonna say i'll give him the benefit of the doubt just just because uh, i don't know maybe he was lucky for all those kills and uh Okay, we can't give him the benefit of that. This guy is a definite ruler, and uh, you can just tell that by the by the way he just like he he's cautious at the right times every time. I mean, some people you you might think that they're walling because they're being cautious around corners, but then you'll notice that they're cautious around every corner. However, this guy, if you notice when he was coming back out to go to short from um long, he didn't like um. He, he, he didn't check all his corners. He only was shifting and checking the corner where the guy was. So, um, yeah, this guy I definitely do think is using wall hacks. And um, we can see now that he is going to go long again. And um, there is the guy watching long. So, I reckon he's not going to peek it. Or he is. Ooh, he's getting a bit confident for himself. But, uh, yeah, now he's got the peek on the guy. He, he knows that there's only one guy there. He knows that this guy is watching long. Depending on what hacks he has, he might... um know what weapon the guy has but look at that just knows he's coming out it aims for it where the head would be and gets that easy kill i might watch a little bit more just to see if this guy's using any other kind of hacks i don't think he's going to be uh, i don't think he's got any like bunny hop scripts or anything um uh, aim assistance i don't think he has either i think it's just been um aim all but, but down to himself he hasn't been getting constantly headshots that will be in all kind of kills i think right now that this guy's just using wall hacks and wall hacks alone um it might be kind of like an esp kind of thing rather than wall hacks but um either way they both are vision assistants so um yeah through the smoke 100 percent i'll show you guys how you fast forward it so to fast forward it it's pretty simple what you want to do is press shift and f2 and um you'll bring up this little menu thing here and what you want to do is this slider thing underneath the um time speeds you want to max it up to 1000 and then it will just zoom through the whole gameplay and um you'll get yourself right to the end where you can submit your verdict this guy's using the AWP now, he's, I don't think he was trying to hide it, after that kill through the smoke, he, he's not going to try and hide it, um, I don't know why he wouldn't just like go full out and just try and kill everyone and anyone, but uh, yeah, this guy 100% wall hacks and um, now we can just wait until we get to the end. Alright, so we've got to the end of the game here. We can press Shift F2 again just to close that little menu thing. And um, now we can decide what he was doing. So aim assistance, insufficient evidence. I don't think he was using aim assistance. Vision, definitely. He was killing people through the smoke left, right and center. He was just getting um, all the kills. So definitely he had vision assistance. Other external assistance, not too sure he might have had... Um, uh, like other things but he wasn't really showing them so i'm gonna have to say insufficient evidence and a griefing kind of anti-social behavior um he wasn't doing any of that he was just being kind of a dickhead with all his woolers but um other than that that was it he is using the wall hacks and um hopefully enough people will be um overwatching this and he will get the ban of the overwatch and not be able to participate in any more global offensive games but that is about it for this video or this episode hopefully you did enjoy it we caught ourselves a definite scripting kiddie last episode i don't really know whether that that guy did have walls or not um 
it's still a mystery to me. But anyway, I've been Rahul. Hopefully you have enjoyed this video. And as always, catch you in the next one.